Hi, crafty friends. Hey, the next time you're at Dollar Tree, grab a pack of these doilies. I love that there's um, four different sizes in this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a bunting out of these. And I love buntings because they're normally like fabric or sometimes like canvas, but I thought, man, they would be super cool with these doilies. So um, I only need to paint the red, uh, a set of them red and then a set blue. And I'm using some of the, uh, these little sponges from Dollar Tree so that we can get kind of, I didn't want them to be all blue or all red. So I just kind of was like stippling this on there. Um, and I really like how it turned out, especially the blue. It's almost, um, when it dries, it's kind of like this denim look. It's super duper cool. So loving, loving, loving how this turned out. So um, again, just doing the red and the blue and we are going to let them dry up really good. And then I grabbed some of the double-sided tape from the Dollar Tree. You can see that I uh, folded them in half and that's what we're going, that's the kind of the line that we're using for this tape to put in our twine because uh, that's how we're going to hang them to create um, the bunting. And the great thing about this, you guys, is as I was doing this, so I was like, oh my gosh, we could do like for birthday parties or just other, you know, events or holidays or whatever. We could do so many different colors. We could add glitter. We, I, uh, the possibilities are endless. So my mind was like reeling as I was doing this. I thought, what a fun idea to do for buntings. They always don't have to be patriotic. But so I'm again using the double-sided tape and we're just kind of holding that down. And um, we've got this on the twine. Now, originally I had pulled out those scarves because I thought, oh, I could do like a thin layer of those. No, sorry, not a layer, like a thin strip and hang them from those. But I didn't want to distract from how cool these turned out. So we're just going to layer these up um, with the different sizes so you can kind of see that scalloped edge. And so we're really going for that bunting look. Um, and then we'll do this one with the white and then the blue on top. Now, when I started to put the, um, this one is the, the biggest doily, this red one. So then when I did the other two sides, I made those a little bit smaller you know, I sized down with the doilies because I wanted it to give it, you know, that look of different sizes, but also because the way we're going to hang those, I didn't want them to hang too bulky um, because I was just leaving a little bit of twine in between there. So um, if you guys haven't used this double-sided tape before, it cracks me up uh, or I crack myself up uh, because I'll get it on there and then I start to pull up and I'm pulling up the tape and I'm like, okay, push it down, push it down, pull up again. So just give yourself a little grace there because I was like, oh my gosh, why can't I get this to work? But look how stinking cute this turned out. Oh my gosh. I Seriously, my mind is reeling with other ideas. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to follow for more.